Ah. Hi everyone, I just thought uh, this is the third birthday, I better do a quick video. I've not done it in front of the organ this year or in my lounge because it's uh, we're in the middle of spring here. Actually I'm recording this on the 31st of uh, October and of course when you see it it'll be the 1st of November which will be tomorrow which is our third birthday. We've come a long way since then of course. Um, I'd like to welcome everyone who's joined the group who I've never spoke to yet. Obviously it gets too much to try and contact everybody. I used to for the first thousand people that joined us um, and the admin group do try and cope with everybody else. But we've reached 2,500 members, friends, and I suppose we're still known as the family amongst ourselves. We're one of the warmest, friendliest groups. And we also have a great system where everybody shares the music. We don't criticize each other. We try and stay friendly. Uh, the admin group and I try and keep the adverts out, of course. That's one of the hardest ones to do. Adverts and, uh, let's just say, non-suitable type posts. But we do a good job. And everybody makes the group what it is. I mean, all of you who put in posts or share something, helping keeping in the way the organ world alive. Although I will say it's wonderful now. There's so many new groups in starting organ groups. Uh, and yeah, I've backed heaps of them that have started now. I lend my support. The same way as the people lend their support to this one. Um, yeah, it's not the same group. But I enjoy posting their groups just as they enjoy posting in my group. They serve different purposes. The important thing is we've managed to keep the organ and the keyboard world alive a little bit in our own way. Um, I should have put my hat on here actually, the sun's blazing down on me. It's about quarter past four in the afternoon, so there's a bit of a northwester wind blowing at the moment. A bit gusty. In fact, you can't hear the birds chirping. This is my rockery. I planted this last year. Um, some of you will remember when I put the pictures in and I first put the rocks in. And Luckily, some of the plants are beginning to spread out. Well, um, I bought a solar waterfall, no, a little solar fountain. I've had it here as a fountain. I'm gonna build a waterfall here, so I need to rearrange some of the brickwork. This actually, the rocks were part of the, um, we had a rotary washing line, a massive, big imitation cobbled concrete thing, which just cracked up in the earthquake and I destroyed it slowly. A lot of the rockery finished up under the trees over there. And I had some pine trees here when we moved in, big scotch pines. And unfortunately, although I'd taken the tops off and brought them all down, some of the bases like had gone horizontal and grown through and I couldn't get them out. So underneath there is the base of the pine trees. The rocks came from the washing line. Um, <laughs> in a way, we've just finished really having our house fixed for the final part. So, so things are sorting themselves out. And in the midst of all that, of course, uh, yeah, I've made the group, I started the group, and, and it's come to where it is. Um, again, I'd like to thank everybody who's put a little bit of time in and shared the friendship in the group. You know, we've got a, lot, a few subgroups, we've got a lot of friends floating around. Um, some have passed away since we started the group. Others who've joined us haven't shared anything yet. That's okay, it doesn't matter. We can't all share everything at once. We fill it up completely. Uh, but what I will say is that we've had a really, really lovely range of music shared. And it's inspired many of us to, you know, venture into something else, music-wise, organ-wise. Um, a friend of mine on the group, funnily enough, said he's just got a GA3, which is what I play. And that's wonderful for him. Uh, hope he'll enjoy it. Organ preferences are a funny thing. To me, it's personal. It depends on how you play the organ and what you have. And it doesn't matter what you've got. Um, it's nice to hear different organs, different keyboards, and also the different ways people play them. 
We've tried in the group to share things from the manufacturers, Versi, Bohm, Lowry, um, for example, and if there's anything pops up from Yamaha, uh, we've tried to share those as well. And also functions that you can go to. We're not advertising the functions, it's just that it gives you a chance to know they're actually there. Um, I don't class that as advertising, that's information. Um, I only ever went to one big function and that was just before we left the UK. I went in 1994 to the AOC National Organ Festival at Morgan and met uh, some great organists and some beautiful performers, uh, many of whom were in the group, funnily enough. Uh, and it, that was inspirational for me and I took my family, my kids, and of course most of you know my kids still play, my son plays sort of uh, a couple of nights a week or one night on a Saturday in the week he plays for sequence dance and he's a percussionist he knows how to play the organ of course my daughter Jennifer uh, the son's name's John by the way our daughter Jennifer of course uh, is a singer now professional singer um, she played the organ had organ lessons did the recorder she's played the flute trumpet she used to have drum lessons along with John when we lived in England um, and became a professional singer. As it happened this year, she, her and her husband perform as a group called Vintage, a duo called Vintage Blue. They, they met at jazz school. Uh, they perform in Christchurch. But she, uh, her husband, a singer, formed a duo called Itty Bitty Beats and they do children's songs that they've written themselves and this year last year they were finalists in the Vodafone New Zealand Best Song Awards this year they won it and they won the best children's album as well um, so she's in the process now of doing a video because this year next year's competition has been pushed forward but all these things come from the music and the music's important some of us find it relaxing um, I unwind by playing the organ. When I was first playing and I started work, uh, I used to get home from, I was an apprentice plant fitter, I used to go to college as well, and I'd get home from work late after doing a late night school at college, and my mum would say the following day, oh you were playing the organ heavy last night, and we used to have a Larry citation spin it, and I'd say, well you wouldn't have heard me, I had headphones on. And my mum or my dad would say, yeah, but you were really thumping the pedals with your feet. And they could hear my foot banging the pedals. So, um, yeah, I use mine for unwinding. It's, it's great. The thing is, you get what you want out of your music. You get what you want out of the instruments. And if you enjoy it, that's fine. And if you can share it with other people, that's wonderful. Um, again, I'd like to thank you all because it's what the work you put in that actually makes this uh, this group stay where it is and survive if you have any ideas you know pop the idea to me or one of the admin group on a post or you can always email me I think my email address is on my YouTube channel which is 2009C but if you ever link onto one of my YouTubes you'll find it um, and we'll see what we can do because you know variety is the spice of life as they say I should have left my dark glasses on actually for this because the sun's over there um, without them actually I can see the camera just about but I can't read what it says to me that's how bad my eyes are but unfortunately my glasses are photochromic so you'd have just got these two black boxes anyway thanks once again we've reached three years as a group, which is great, on Facebook, we're popular, and hopefully we give you what you want, and what more can I say, we're across the world, I mean I'm sitting in New Zealand, this is why it's summer, I still haven't, I've been here 21 years now, I still haven't got used to the fact that Christmas is in summer, because I'm a Christmas baby, you know, I'm born on the 20th of December, so Christmas to me is always dark nights, bright Christmas trees. We have to shut the curtains here so I can see the Christmas tree lights. 
put the air conditioning on and dress in woolies on Christmas Day just to get the feel for it. But um, and of course it's summer holidays here, so the kids have the summer holidays and people go away in at Christmas. But it, that's all a mental attitude as well, just as music is. The thing is, if you get out of the music something, you know, whether it's relaxation or enjoyment or it brings ideas forward, isn't that what it's all about? So, again, happy birthday everyone. Um, hopefully this video will be okay. <laughs> Have a look when it going. If you need to talk to me or any of the group, any of the admin group, just pop us a uh, message. Um, if you need to find us actually, and you don't see a post, if you go into the members list, it'll bring them up. I think my name appears first because I created the group. So if you go into members list, the first name will be mine. Um, and most of the admin ones have been there longest anyway, so their names won't be too far down the list. I must admit, 2,500 is a big list. So, happy birthday. Um, it'd be nice to be doing this again next year, same time. Take care, everyone. No drinks this time, look, look, I've been good. Um, shortly most of these flowers will close because the sun will go behind the clouds. But yeah, it's bright in the corner up and I hope the group brightened up Facebook a bit for a lot of you. So take care and thank you from me, the admin group and from everybody. Happy birthday.